had it in my hand. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone. Hey, folks, welcome back to Chris White Africa. Breaking news out of South Africa. Urgent update here. Just trying to get you up to speed. What's happening at this hour? Shocking news. The first ever victim of the African National Congress's expropriation without compensation amendment to the Constitution has been identified. We have identified the first victim ever of expropriation without compensation, property disappearing from none other than President Cyril Ramaphosa. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, the first ever victim. Watch this right here. So welcome, Mr. President. Look, I'm waiting for my iPad. Somebody stole my iPad. <laughs> huh? Somebody decided that they want to dispossess me of my iPad. So I want that. Can I have my iPad, please? So there you have it, folks. South Africa's first ever victim of expropriation without compensation. Cyril Ramaphosa has been dispossessed. His own words. His property taken from him without just cause. Ah, but under EWC, expropriation without compensation, Cyril, it's legal for the state to steal from you. <laughs> Cyril can't find his iPad. I found it. It's right here in central Pennsylvania. So they stole it. Where's your iPad? I don't know. No idea, Cyril. Don't know where your iPad is. Hmm? I had my iPad. So why did you know where they took my iPad to? <laughs> this is the problem of always handing out your gadgets to other people. It's always best that I should keep all these things with me all the time. I had my iPad. I had it in my hand. It's gone. Where's his iPad? Who took this poor Oak's iPad? My goodness. Cyril Ramaphosa. What's it like to be the victim of expropriation without compensation? What does it feel like when somebody takes your property, Cyril? Tell us about that. What's it like? They've lost it, it seems. Should I sit down? Okay. Should I sit down now? Yes, sit down and be quiet. What an embarrassment. If the African National Congress isn't ready to vote this guy with no vote of confidence, the rest of Parliament should be. Unbelievable. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this would be hilarious if it were just not so embarrassing. This is the president of a country, of South Africa. Yes, I know, as an American, I have all the embarrassment that's heaped on us because of the Manchurian cadaver. We have to deal with that. I'm well aware of the embarrassment that is Joe Biden. But Cyril Ramaphosa, Supposedly has his faculties about him. Where is my iPad? They stole my iPad. And he has no idea. He's completely clueless. He has no idea what to do. He can't speak. He, he, he can't even hold a conversation. He's so discombobulated. This is the leader of a country. This is the man that assures us that the reason South Africa can't give the jab to its citizens is because of racism and because of vaccine apartheid by the evil global north who conspire to keep South Africans from getting the jab. Hmm. I had my iPad. Just one word of advice, Cyril. You know that they do have these little things, these apps that you put on your other device and it will find your iPad for you, right? Where's my iPad? His app. Hmm. Poor Cyril. Where is his iPad? Should I sit down? 
Okay. This is the leader of a country. This is it. Where is my iPad? Hey, folks, if you're not subscribed to Chris White Africa, <laughs> why not become one? Smash that subscription button right down there at the bottom of the screen. And be sure to toggle the bell icon if you want to get notified of our updates, live streams, prepared videos, and all the other shenanigans here as we cover events across Africa with a special focus on Southern Africa and South Africa in particular. Poor Cyril. Where is his iPad? Where is his iPad? I had it in my hand. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone.